Arpita and Geeta don't know each other. They have different lives and yet a very similar story. Arpita lives in a metro city, Mumbai, and Geeta lives in a village called Dhamni. They have a daughter each and are both doting mothers. Arpita's daughter is five and has begun school this year. And Geeta's daughter is in the seventh grade. They both grew up learning something that a huge percentage of Indian women are yet to unlearn. They grew up using old clothes during their periods. This practice is all they knew and they never questioned it. So when Geeta's daughter reached puberty, she was given an old cloth to use during her periods too. Puberty is a difficult time in a girl's life and to be mocked at school for a stained uniform is not something Geeta's daughter was prepared for. She wanted to leave school. In India, more than 280 million women still use old clothes during periods. The biggest reason of such unhygienic practice is low awareness, which often costs these women their health. Thousands of women lose their lives to cervical cancer in India. But for Geeta, Arpita and their daughters, things completely changed when they became part of the Happiness Project. An initiative by Nexus to educate women and teenage girls about menstruation, safe practices and hygiene. The Happiness Project works with NGOs and local government bodies and has conducted workshops across seven cities in five different languages. There are more than 25,000 women like Arpita and Geeta who have been facilitated with free sanitary pads. The Happiness Project is on its way to reach 100,000 underprivileged women and girls by 2022.